Oh my god. Yeah, actually, I actually built my uh, stand correct. There we go, that's like 400 damage off the bat. He literally got killed by my skills. Bad. I'm I, was I'm steal the I, loot. Was, I was literally able to take out their whole team by myself. That's how you know this build's insane. Okay guys, for this video I'm going to be showing you guys the best build for the best class in my opinion. There's two classes that I genuinely feel like are the best for PvP and that's the Swordmaster and the uh, Pyromancer. So for this video I'm going to be focusing on the Swordmaster. And there's actually builds you could do. My favorite mode actually in this game right now is the Team Deathmatch. If you guys haven't tried this uh, mode out in Dungeon Board, please try it out. It's actually so fun. I actually find this to be uh, more fun than the Extraction um, uh, mode. But... I'm going to just show you guys what you want to spec in when you get into the game. Because with this build, I'm doing like, uh, every match I'm doing like nearly 12k to uh, uh, 12k to 16k damage. And if you guys uh, play the team deathmatch mode, you, you understand how cracked that is and how much damage that is. And just, I mean, I go like, I have high KDs and everything. So, for um, Swordmaster, the uh, stats you really want to spec into is you want to get your strength to 54. Because if you get your strength to 54, you're going to get the passive. That makes your psionic blades uh, restore 30 life um, on hit when it's unblocked damage. What that means is when someone's not blocking and you hit them with the psionic blade, which uh, four spawns, you're getting 30 life for each. So if you hit that 54 strength mark, you're going to get this passive. It's just insanely OP. And then for dexterity, you, I mean, you can't really hit um, dex uh, 72 unless you have a high level sword master. So what I aim for is just getting 35 um dexterity which is pretty easy and so that um perk it, like you you could focus the second dex but i feel like the other like these two perks are more useful than just going straight for dexterity so what the 35 dexterity gives is uh, increases your critical chance uh by 50 uh 50 percent for five seconds after hitting an enemy so like with psionic blades uh, and so what this means is when you use psionic blades after that if you go in for the like uh the kill you're going to just be hitting crit 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 which is actually insane especially if you build um uh high crit uh, crit damage so you're going to just be hitting so much crit and just doing so much damage you literally can't lose a fight and then this is by far the most important perk if uh if i were to like emphasize the importance of each perk and each passive it would be probably um deflection Healing Scarab, and then probably Momentum, and then Will. So what what um stamina does when you get it to 36 stam, while using uh, Whirling Blade, it's the it's your E ability. All damage taken is reduced by 50%. That is absolutely insane for just 36 stam. This like 36 stam is not hard to hit. I will show you guys like these three are most likely gonna um get enough stat points when we get into the team deathmatch mode. I'm gonna show you guys how to build it, and then Will. Like if you have enough, um, if you have enough will and uh left, or you really got like uh the good items and stuff, you could build into this too. This is pretty good. After sight, uh, like after hitting three or four sh shots with psionic blade, the skill two down uh cooldown is reduced by ten or fifteen seconds. This is really good because psionic blade is definitely like probably the most OP um ability for this character. It hits for like four hundred, gives you health, slows them down. It's just like insane. And then on top of that, with momentum, it gives you a uh, crit chance. So I'm going to be uh, playing with one of my friends. And we're going to go into a team death match. And I'm going to show you guys how to build and how to like proc all these passes. And I'm going to show you guys a full uh, game of gameplay of uh, this sword master build. If you guys like this video, please like and sub. And if you guys want me to make a power master build, that's probably what I'm going to do next. Because power master is also really cracked. And so I'm going to do that for my next video. Thanks for this game. We're got, we just gotta hope that we're getting better stuff. Okay, yeah, that's already a better start. More stam on our items. I don't know. What we'll, I'm gonna I'm gonna go for will because uh, my dexterity weapons give it to me really fast. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna go for more stam. Uh, you know what? I'm actually gonna do that because it just has better perks. Okay, that's really good. Life on hit is what you really want. Life on hit and shield while activating skills are kind of crack uh, perks. And so, oh, another life on kill. This is just insane because, you know, with um, Swordmaster, you attack very fast. And being able to... What's Faith? What does Faith do? Uh, faith is not good for you. It's good for, like, maybe other builds, but not for what you're rocking right now. Okay, I'll do this. Ooh, I just did this. Uh, physical penetration, max damage, increased stacks on kill, plus three stamina. 
That's perfect, yeah. Alright, so we just want to get a lot of life on hit. And just, like, life on kill and all that. Because we're just going to be snowballing until, like, uh, until, like, strong, uh, What's Tangle and Chain? Tangle and Chain? I'm not really sure what that does. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay, we're gonna. Uh, this one has really bad secondary perks, but it does give us stamina. Will, yeah, I'm gonna just do that. Okay, now we want, we need some more. St we need stam and strength. Let's see if we could get a stam ring that gives strength. All life on hit. I do want that. Let's see how much. Okay, I could run that. Oh, now I'm running. I have all my perks. Uh, that's perfect. And if you guys didn't know, if you're uh, upgrading Will, you actually do more damage with your skills. And I'm going to get this life on hit. Yeah. I, the, like, for this game, I'm, I actually have everything ideally what I want it to be. I got all of my um, perks. Except for the 72 decks, but we don't want that. I'm just going to be camping out these swords. Get as Okay, there we go. Yeah, they're not winning this. I, they're running, uh, I think, two... I don't know if they're running. Maybe Swordmaster, like I am. They're probably still at spawn, going for swords. I'm going to just show you guys how strong this build is. That's one of them. We're just going to run out. There we go. Now I'm going to go back in with uh, Psionic Blades. Uh, he my teammate Loki blocked my damage, but whatever. I was able to take out one of them, got other, the other one low enough for my teammate to take him out. He's gonna pray right here, get some health. Right, there we go. There we go. The Druid's a little dangerous if I don't pay attention to him, I was able to take. Oh. He's chasing me. I'll just pray right here, get some health back. I'm coming! I healed up, I'm gonna go back up here and uh, I think I could take them out again. Oh, the rogue's over there. Okay, we just wanna, I'm gonna just, just come out real quick. And I don't even damage you. Yeah, I you just come, yeah, just come back up here. They're gonna because they're invincible when they're in there. What the hell? Something just damaged me. Yeah, just say so, yeah. We we don't want them to get their invincible uh fight them invincibility. We're just giving them. Free Look at me. Look at me. <laughs> Little rat. Is one of them trying to sneak up? I need some more swords actually. I'm just hit. Yo, one of them's okay. I'm retarded. I'm gonna go back and get some more heals. You're on your own. My whole team's fighting, I'm just here looting up swords. Oh my god, he's blade blading it up in there. Come, come back out here. Uh. Oh my god, they haven't even got you low. Oh my god. Don't worry, you don't even take damage when I do this. Oh, one of them just got killed. I'm just waiting. For okay, there we go. This arm thing's off. He's dead. Uh, just like leave this guy because uh, uh, he's invincible oh, yeah. here. Bro, they didn't even get me low, bro. I'm up. Oh my god. I got you. Oh, right, he's low. Oh, I'm Ow. still alive. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm gonna go for a high KD match this time. I'm just healing. Hi, there we go. Oh, I just got one of them. Easy. Bro, this is so boring because, bro, they're not even getting, uh, bro, they're not even leaving their spawn anymore. I think we scared them. It's 12-2. If you want, go to a healing shrine. It's uh, back there. Yeah, keep yeah, keep heading the way you're heading. Yeah. Now make a right, I think. Should be there. Yes, sir. Oh, my God. Yeah, actually, I actually built my uh, stand correct. There we go, that's like 400 damage off the bat. He literally got killed by my skill. Bad. 
I'm gonna I was literally, steal the I, was, loot. I was literally able to take out their whole team by myself. That's how you know this build's insane. It just like, literally the um the what's it called the rogue just got hit by all my um just my skills and just died straight up because of how much damage the skills do. My swords do I think if I hit all four they do like more than 400 damage, close to 500 damage. And then my E rota uh, rotates around me every second, and that's like 70 damage each. And then I take 50% less damage, which is just this build just like. Oh, they're all low. This, clock, uh, this class, this build is just insane. Yeah, these guys are just. I'm, I'm surprised they haven't left the game. I'm just gonna go in there and bomb rush them again. Look at this. Sniper. Look at this. And this bypass is blocked, so he can't even block that. No one could actually block that. He's just just trying to run, I guess. I could still see him. I don't know if he thinks the invisibility is actually good in this game. And then you see, after I hit that, oh my, he's just dead. Oh my god. The druid's trying to eat my ass. The druid's Pause. Oh my god. I need help. I need reinforcement. Need reinforcements, please. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. They're chasing me. Come, 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 come. Okay, they're gonna be right here. Surprise, motherfucker. Oh shit. Oh shit. Where's my. They're both dead. Yo, well, my boy's trying He's to hit right. you with a blade blade. Stay in his blade blade, bro. Yeah, bro. Oh my god, phonic, 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 phonic. And my teammate trying to take my heals for what? I'm gonna just go back there and get some more heals. More swords, I mean. Yeah, the only thing about this build is that you constantly need to come back and pick up your swords. <sighs> oh, this game's about to end in 20 seconds. Uh, I'm just go try to get one. I think I, I think I had like a ultra positive KD. I was like. 20, 20 to 1. Bro, I can't take out another one. Oh, wow, okay. Let me see if I can get one more. No, they're running. Oh my god. No, they're running. Yeah, okay. <laughs> you think you're funny. <laughs> you think you're funny. Look at that. Yo, 14 let me see me. Let me see. KD. 14 0. Oh, that's you. <sighs> 3 2. Damn, Damn, bro. Look at me. That, that's I'm good. up there. I mean that's good. Like, guys, this Thank build's you. cracked. This class nah. is cracked. Yeah. Sigh. <laughs> okay, so if you guys enjoyed this video, please like and sub. And if you guys have any um classes that you want me to make a build for, like explain how to play the build, I'll be making those uh, type of videos. You guys just gotta put it down in the comments below. And uh, thank you for watching.